Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Simply Destiny. I'm so, so excited that I'm finally recording another video. I know it's been so long. I've been having some technical difficulties with my computer and Final Cut Pro, but today I decided to not delay any further and to just go ahead and record on my phone. So that's why we're gonna make this video pretty short because it's my first time recording on my phone and I wanna make sure it doesn't cut off or do anything crazy. So as you guys can see by the title today, I am going to share with you guys about, I think it's five essential school supplies that will really help you get through nursing school. It got me through and so um, I think it'll be really helpful and essential in your progression through your program. So without further ado, let's get right into it. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna talk about is um, the use of flashcards. Flashcards are so helpful. They help you, well, for me, I use them when I am writing key terms down. There's a lot of processes that go into just different diseases. So for me, um, flashcards help me sort through that stuff. It's, it can be very overwhelming, but I feel like they have really helped me get a better grasp of disease processes. So that's why I use flashcards and my flashcards are color coded. I'm just gonna take them out. So there's like purple, there's green, there's yellow, yeah, yellow and um, some other colors. But what I do is I color code. So green may be um, just key terms and then purple may be different diseases and their processes. And then blue may be just like some super, super important information that I need to make sure I hold on to um, for NCLEX, for exams, whatever. So I would definitely recommend the use of flashcards. Um, you can get them from Target. I think I got this little um, note card holder from Target or Amazon. You know, Amazon is everyone's go-to. So you can just go on Amazon and get the colored coded note cards and a flash card holder. So there's that. Um, then my next thing. So I know in my previous video where I talked about what's in my nursing student um, school bag, I mentioned these things. It's like sticky notes, but it's in like this little booklet. So I did not utilize these for um, to-do lists. I know I mentioned that I was gonna really hold myself accountable to making to-do lists this semester because I am in my third semester. This semester is labor and delivery, um, nursing care of the child, which is pediatrics and pharmacology. And I was really trying to hold myself accountable to doing to-do lists, which I did. I just didn't utilize these. Instead, I utilized these for like um, clinical because I got really tired of carrying big, we're not necessarily big, but like medium sized, thick um, notebooks because it would just be so big and bulky in my lab coat. So I just found that using these are really, really helpful. It's really small, compact, so you can just stick it in your pocket and keep it going. Um, especially when you're taking different patients' uh, vitals, that can be so annoying when you just have like paper everywhere, you're trying to write down their vitals, you're writing it down in your glove, you know, it, it becomes a lot. So this was really helpful, especially when nurses would give really important information. Um, I would just go ahead and write it on these stickies. So I utilize this and I got it from Amazon. So definitely get some sort of small, miniature notebook that's not too big and bulky that you can just really carry around with you to every clinical. It's really helpful, especially if your um, clinical instructors require you to do like journals after each clinical rotation. It's really helpful to refresh your memory on what you went over that day. You know, some important information that you might not learn in class that the nurses, you know, on the unit can share with you because they're really knowledgeable. So boop get one of these and uh yeah like i said i got this from amazon the next thing i know for sure i mentioned this in my um what's in my nursing student bag so if you haven't checked that video out go ahead and check that out um but these let me just take this out these are like sticker note flags so 
Um, I just go ahead and use these when I'm reading through my textbook. It's so helpful because you know where you left off, you know this page is super important to go back to, you know that this page has some key terms that you're gonna need to know, and um, I just go ahead and stick these in. Um, I, as you can see, they're color coded, so the red one I use for pages that have super, super important information like certain drugs and their um, side effects or just key points that you need to hold on to for NCLEX and for maybe your um, class exams. So definitely get these. I got this from the dollar store. I don't know if you guys have dollar stores where you are located, but you can get it on Amazon, I'm sure. So there's that. Then these felt tip pens, guys. This is like my holy grail. I love these pens with a passion. Like these are awesome. So um, like I've mentioned before, when I write my notes, my notes um, are written in a pencil. So it's really bland. It's really just like blah. But these take my notes to the next level. I'm able to really like my eyes go straight to whatever I've written in these colors because usually I will write important information in these color in these pens or I'll underline some important stuff. So it just helps me flow through my notes a little bit better. Um, so I would encourage you guys, if you guys do write in pencil, if you write out your notes, not even just if it's written in pencil, if you are the type of student that writes your notes out, um, use these because it's really helpful, you know? Um, also, you can just keep carry this with you at clinical, whatever the case, these are really, really helpful. So keep that in mind. I got this from Target. If you want to, get highlighters of course you can get highlighters and you can just highlight um because i didn't mention i didn't mention highlighters in this video i'm not going to show you guys highlighters because you know those are the basic things like highlighters pencils pens paper but if you don't like writing um pens you can go ahead and just use highlighters i would like to um, mention that these do not bleed through your paper so if you are writing in these on regular paper it won't bleed through so there's that. Oh my gosh. And this next thing, guys, this is so important to stay organized, to help you stay organized throughout your program because being a nursing student is so easy to just, I don't know, your mind just goes a million miles per hour, like per second actually. And so this bad boy has been a game changer for me. This is a 2020 planner. I know with everything going on with this coronavirus, nobody not doing nothing in 2020, but you know, it still has helped me keep up with my schoolwork guys. Oh my gosh. I've always like idolized people who are so organized, who use, um, planners who actually have like stickers and that sort and I have turned into that person just a little bit I haven't gone to the extreme yet um but I'm working my way there I'm working my way there but these but this planner has really helped me stay organized it's very very important for you guys to stay organized while you are in nursing nursing school because you get a lot of assignments you have a lot of different due dates you have a lot of obligations and a planner will really help you stay on top of your game. I have noticed that I have stayed on top of my game just within the short couple of months, you know, of using this planner. And so that is why I recommend a planner. If not anything in this video, please make sure you get a planner. And the next, and also the next thing I'm gonna mention is also really important, but this right here, it's a lifesaver. And it also feels really good. I know I mentioned this before. It feels really good to just check off what you've accomplished, what you've completed for the day. It just feels good, you know? And so you need those little, little, little pick-me-ups, you know? Um, make you feel like you're on top of what you're on top of, even though sometimes it might not feel like you are. But yeah, so this is the month of April. It's the second day of April and I already have a good amount of stuff filled out in my planner. I'll go to March. um oopsies hold on so yeah just show you guys some stuff that i wrote in my planner 
it's just really helpful. I hope you guys can see this. But yeah, it's just really helpful to have a planner. So I would for sure recommend a planner. If nothing else, a planner. Okay, so sorry, my phone almost died. So um, the last thing I'm gonna show you guys is my Mac laptop. Um, this is the 13 inch laptop, I believe. Um, I got this on Black Friday. So I would encourage you guys to get some sort of laptop even if it's not an actual laptop it can even be a um, ipad it doesn't have to be a mac uh, um, laptop it can be any laptop i just would recommend it because you just really never know especially with this whole virus going on right now you know i just like millions of other students are forced to do online learning so this really came in clutch for me um when you can't go to like the library and get things done you have your own Thing to just grab, go, and get your stuff done when you need to get done. It has really helped me a lot. And also, not even just like online or virtual learning, a lot of our content this semester has been online anyways. Like we utilize CoursePoint. I don't know if you guys um, you use that in your program, but my program utilizes CoursePoint, Kaplan, just a lot of things online. So that's what really prompted me to get a laptop this semester. So, bam laptop get you one get you an ipad get you a surface get you something like that save up for it it's definitely going to be worth it and that really concludes my video guys really short really simple really sweet um i will see you guys in my next upload please make sure you comment make sure you subscribe make sure you like if you guys have any specific videos you want to see me record please make sure you comment that down below um what else what else do i want to say to you guys please please make sure you guys are staying safe make sure you're staying home make sure you're washing your hands with soap and water make sure you guys are just being positive especially with what's going on right now just be positive just utilize this time to breathe to relax to meditate to pick up that hobby that you've always wanted to pick up to just center yourself okay please do not just look at all the bad it's a lot of good coming out of this and just stay positive. That's really all I have to say. I will see you guys in my next upload. Ooh.